Good morning, everyone. A Chiefs win in week 17 would clinch a first round bye and home field advantage throughout the AFC playoffs. Spoiler alert. The Chiefs got that win, doing so in style as KC continues to rewrite the record books in Patrick Mahomes' breakout, nay, MVP season. The Chiefs have already smashed the franchise scoring record going into Sunday's game, but Mahomes would extend his own team records for passing yards and touchdowns. First drive of the game, guess who? Tyreek Hill, 67-yard touchdown. That's a new single-season franchise record for receiving yards 1,479 later in the first. Derek Carr of Oakland. I don't know where he's looking for there. Jared Cook certainly wasn't paying attention. Daniel Sorensen takes it 54 yards to the house. Chiefs up 21-3 at halftime. In the third, Mahomes steps up. You know he's going to send it. Demarcus Robinson beating one-on-one -on -one coverage. 89 yards, touchdown number 50 for Pat. He also goes over 5,000 yards. Only Peyton Manning has done that in the same season. One more record would fall Sunday. Travis Kelsey breaking Rob Gronkowski's tight end receiving yardage record. 1,336 for Kelsey. Now Niners tight end George Kittle broke that record an hour later. But hey, the Chiefs are the top seed in the AFC. The road to the Super Bowl runs through Arrowhead. And here are a look at the playoff matchups. Indianapolis won last night against Tennessee. The Colts will go to Houston on Saturday of Wild Card Weekend. The LA Chargers will go out east to play Baltimore, the four seed after they won Sunday to become AFC North champions. On the Hardwood Sunday, the Missouri State men blew out William Woods in NAIA school, a school record 17 three-pointers for the Bears. They finish up non-conference play with a big win. And the Lady Bears finish up non-conference play on a three-game win streak, taking out Arkansas Little Rock 48-44. And with a look at your Monday morning sports, I'm Dan Malloy. Happy almost New Year.